Hey guys, welcome. I'm here with something I have not done in quite a while. A Dollar Tree haul. That's right. It was under $60, which for me is insanely a miracle. But yeah, let me um take you guys through what I got. Hey guys, welcome. I'm Tracy. This is my channel, Tracy from the Mermaid Cove. Doesn't Tracy from the Mermaid Cove should have a mermaid? And the thing is, I am going to try to do something with it. I'll put it right on my art table. She's too cute for school. $1.25, of course, but hey. Yeah, so, you know, I'm learning to do better at the Dollar Tree. And, you know, this 25-day thing is helping because it's time and energy. But, yeah, I love going in, I love going in the Dollar Tree. But like I said, my dad started me off on Woolworths, and my mom and I would go all the time. So I'm finding my balance, but look at these. So these were $3, right? But I really love them. I only got two. Um, I want to try them out in my studio. And, um, you know, if they don't have any more, they don't have any more. They'll have something. But yeah, so that is for my studio. Or I want to do something on my top shelf with my cans. I feel like they're falling all the time. But I don't know if I want something that I can put too much in, you know, and pull and just fall. So I'm still working on that. But I think that might be a really good idea. And maybe the better idea is to have everything in the garage and just have one or two of everything. And, you know, even put a note on, I have three more in the garage or something. But let's start with practical, right? Practical stuff. So I just got a new thing of um, gloves to work outside. You know, they're a good grip. $1.25, they're actually pretty decent, you know? I think you can wash them well. And then I got a new bucket. I need one for all my deck and one for downstairs. So I got that. I got another scrub brush. I want to have this for downstairs. I'm working on some of the areas that Oscar, you know, did his business on. And, you know, I'm trying to really scrub in some vinegar solution. I think that helps. And y'all got one scarf. I did. Uh, I haven't been wearing scarves, but maybe I should. But it needs to be ironed because they look so much better ironed, you guys. They truly, truly do. Are y'all having, we're having a beautiful day here. It's un believable on in the DMV but um yeah isn't that cute I love that so let me my convertible right so yeah because that's super cute that's gonna go upstairs and then um I'm gonna iron it and wear it and show you guys it makes all the difference so maybe that will be my upstairs let's see you know what this is so handy, an angle square, and really good in my art too. The only thing if it had been thinner here to rip paper, but for dollar twenty-five, this is a pretty good deal. So I got that. I went in for foil pop-ups. These sell shorter, y'all. I'm not sure. They're still twenty-five, fourteen by ten point twenty-five. I love these things, and I was completely out, and I got one more, but that's at work. They're just so handy to have. And they have this, if y'all do you check, <coughs> check where the clearance is when you first come in. So this was half price. It was 50 cents. They taped it down. So I'm not sure. I mean, you know, it's fine. I can't beat wax paper for 50 cents. I got some more just reusable gloves. I know I have some, but you know, every now and then I get them. I was trying to protect my nails, but you, as you can see, I didn't do a good job. And then all the color just but I'm thinking in today's current uh, economic situation, I'll be doing my own nails because, yeah, that is beyond a luxury right now. So I went for super glue. I got one of these for Beverly. These are the best because first I couldn't see these, and um, but this is glue saver nozzle, so we'll see. But these are perfect. You can't beat them. There's a little strip in my um, kitchen. I need to glue down. So we'll see 
Let's see how that works. And now this is cute. And you know, they ha I wanted to buy one in each color and I didn't. Now I regret it, but I'm gonna put that in my studio. And it's the metal. I just think it's so cute. They have the green. I should have gotten the green and blue, but I'm glad, you know, I didn't and that's fine. And you always, always walk out of there wishing you got more, but you don't because you look at what you have and it's like, I have enough, right? So I'm gonna put um, brushes or paint or something in here or just little tchotchke thingies. So that's to my studio. You guys, this is kind of interesting. Look at that. I do think that 25 extra cents has made a difference, but I don't have anything super wide like a little mini shovel. So I didn't get Beverly one because she has all excellent things. But yeah, got that. I got this um, eyeglass cleaner. Enough said to, I have little bottles, but I thought that could refill them um, for $1.25. Because I'm always, always smudging up my glasses, y'all. Always. I do it. I try to clean them twice, three times a day, but sometimes I don't make it. So let's see. So Palm, everyone was talking about this. Palm Olive Spray Away. So I don't know um, if this is just replaces your dish soap or what but you know in a world where you're trying maybe not to use as much water to spray it let it scrub it off and just a quick rinse maybe or just put it right in the dishwasher i don't know i'll let you guys know what i think of it i mean it smells like disinfectant cleaner and let me see if there's anything else that i would consider practical no this kind of goes with the scarf though so um, they always have the best socks. They do. They didn't have a lot this time, but being Tracy from the Mermaid Cove, I just thought, y'all, I should have some seahorses. And now they're Juncture, but I think Juncture has now made less quality. Oh my God, they're children's. <laughs> I think I get my big old fun. No, I'm just a kid. Okay. I will probably give these to my, um, Seven to two. Probably give them to my niece, Sarah. She lives in Colorado. They probably have something else. That'll go down in my gift closet. Pay attention, but I'm so busy trying to, and you know, I did film. I'm gonna try to hook it up with this, but um, it, the conversation, the voices in my head and the urges all come together to create a moment that I need to be very aware of what's happening. Let's do food. Oh, this is kind of garden. Humming, wildflower blend hummingbird. So I'm thinking this is a mess. Um, so it says for late summer planting, so eight to 10 weeks before the first frost in your area. I don't know. Do you have, I'll ask Beverly about this, but I have an area where I think these could go. We'll see, it's $1.25. Maybe I'll have to, film it for my channel and see if these things are really worth it. All right, so let's do just a couple craft things, like three. How cute, I mean, the stickers are on point right now. They're adorable, I got four. Adorable, just how cute are these? There are so many to choose from. I mean, you know, but I, I have so many, but I just thought, I love this. I have an art thing right now I'm thinking of to put that on, so that. And these, I'm going to put, I've been stapling um, stickers to my mask. So I thought those, that always remind me of my mama. So I thought I would use that and take that to work and, st and staple those on. And then I got some of the crocheted like lace, um, lace ribbon. Let me see, this plastic off, okay. So... I want to do some staining. So I want to try different things. I'm going to do some tea staining. I right now have um, red onion skins um, cooking. So I want to throw them in there and see what happens. And then I grab this. So it's kind of the same thing. This is more crochet-ish. You know, so you get, um, I don't know, 0.78 inches by 78 inches. And this you get um, 0.63 inches, so it's smaller by 108 
inches. So I'll show you guys what I end up doing, but I thought, I don't know, I was just in the mood for that. And let's see. So I got these hair things because now I'm a headband girl. So I've been really good about wearing my hair down. But in the humidity and heat, when I'm gardening, I need, well, you know, keep my hair out of my hat kind of situation. So I don't know about these. Um, I mean, just face it. They're like, I don't know. They're cute. You know, things have changed so much with headbands. They, you know, before they used to poke in your head. And a lot of the good ones, like this one that I have, it, it just doesn't. It's super flexible. But these are okay. I don't mind having a clear one. You know, I just really kind of wanted the clear one. But yeah, so that's, that's good. I like them. They feel good. So I only got allow myself one set. That's all, y'all. Okay. So they had this Frosted Flakes cinnamon basketballs. I always let myself have one to try. I bought a couple for the food bank. They're still in the car. Um, let's try them for you. Some man came right after me. I bought, I got like three. Cause you know, I try to leave some, but the food bank is a good deal. But they, um, he came and took them all. So, wow. Ugh. So not a color you see in nature. to give them to somebody. I'm going to send them to my friend Cindy so her kids can try them. It's okay. I can see why they're left over. It's not like you think, oh my god, these are so good into the store and rush and get a bunch. That's going to be gifted to Cindy and her children. Mermaid cake cup. So they had unicorn and something else, but in general, these are not my favorite things. Especially all this kind of strange colors, but I'm gonna try it one night when I'm desperate. So Duncan Hines Mermaid Cupcake, a dollar twenty-five. It's good till October. Let me see if I can. If you hold it long enough, it'll make it a screenshot that I can choose. So this is new to me, Betty Crocker Triple Berry Muffin Mix. I just love, just to add water and milk, make six muffins. So, you know, I can make one or two for myself and then I can share with a couple people. But what I like to do with these things is add um, to like berries on the top. So when you bite and then a, the raw sugar, so you, there's a crunch and then a burst of um, flavor. So we'll see what I think of it. That's perfect. So well, this was the Fun Betty Oreo Mix. Cookie pieces. So they had the other Fun Betty that is like the colors, the sprinkles. Um, you need oil, water, and three whole eggs. Yeah. Um, so you can do um, three by nine. 13 by 9 inch, 2 8 inch, 2 9 inch, bunt pan, 24 cupcakes. So, um, or you can make cake balls. So I wonder if, if it comes with the um, frosting, y'all. Because who wants this without the frosting? If you use this by, oh my goodness. April of this year. So watch your date. Yeah, you got to make your own. So I'll have to move this up. It's going to make something this week. So maybe I'll make this. But you got to, you know, you'll need some cookie tops on it. So we'll see. Hmm. Okay. I didn't pay attention. That's what you get. I got these things. They were $1.25 and they're terrible. Chocolate covered cashews and I ate more than I should have. But they're big. This is really cheap chocolate. You know what I mean? Not worth trying to digest them. That's 
this to try. Now this, I think, so this was $1.25, and when I went in Big Lots, and I never go in Big Lots, I had a big bag that for $3. So, you know, this really is just for me to try something. The Craters um, Handcrafted Small Batch Popcorn Cheese and Caramel Mix. So, I don't know. I didn't bring my little scissors with me. All right. So, this is good till December. I'm seeing. Okay, so the caramel. I get it. It's like the sweet and salty. Okay. I don't feel like I need a bigger bag or I'll buy it again. I still prefer the Trader Joe's plain old movie theater popcorn. Someone said their kettle corn was good, y'all. Have you tried the Trader Joe's? I haven't tried it. And then we have, um, I just got some mixed fruit freeze dried, vegan friendly, right? It has banana, strawberry, sugar, and mulberries. I'm not sure what a mulberry is. Is that like a blackberry? I've been wanting to try these. So these are the um, fre Fresh Pick Goodness Harvest Snaps Green Pea. They're already expired, y'all. Not sure. So note to self, I mean, I know that, but I was Russian. All right. Let's see. I always have my scissors. I'm out of my Dollar Tree haul ways. White cheddar. First ingredient is peas. Um, they're okay. I just don't think I like things like this. There's always um, natural flavors. So I'll share those at work. Or I'll eat those. Mm. Okay. I'm better off having a piece of cheese and a cracker. So let's try these. Um, so natural, vegan, freeze dried. I don't see a date on here. But, you know, Trader Joe's has. Okay, so let's see. A the strawberry. Hmm. Banana. Something called a mulberry. I guess if you're on the moon, these would be good, right? why you can be eating your fruit person or you're off the grid or something okay i mean I'm, I'm, these are horrible overall this is good but it's just okay good okay well what is this triple berry mix a year all right this one with my friend Amy Jo in Arizona. I'm sending her a little package. She sent me a couple gift cards. Yeah, pretty. It's just such a different take on practice. It's a jot. I got another one of these, you guys. I love these. If you see them, the only thing is like this is super, so you know, it's not sturdy. But what I do sometimes is cut a piece of cardboard I get and make this sturdier. I love all this. And that is Scholar New York, which is a green buyer company. That's why they're always there. And I got um, this for Clara's. Um, she has a thing I put her food on. I feel like she's always just, and it's real awkward to clean all the time. But I thought I could clean this off. Because look how cute that is. Life is just a beautiful ride. 
mostly. And I got tissue paper for Clara. I found some, but she loves to play with the tissue paper. Look how pretty. In case I need to wrap something up. I know I have some somewhere, but anyway, they're gorgeous. $1.25. They had a bunch of different, like, pastels, glitter. And the second to last thing I got is this. So I'm trying to, um, so we've got orange, yellow. Let's see. So one of you, like, if I'm taking pictures, I'm going to have a cuter backdrop than, like, my table or my carpet. You guys, you're going to see my jewelry haul, or those, maybe you weren't, but those of you who are new are popping in because of the Dollar Tree, I'm doing a 25 things a day for 25 days. And some of them are in my jewelry box, and then I show the jewelry, but it just kind of blends in. So I thought, you know, I could, um, you know, have a pretty backdrop when I take Very professional. All for dumbing 25, y'all. Anyway, we'll see. I bought some for that before and then can't find them. These are cute. Anyway, we'll see about that. And then my last thing, you guys, which is total ridiculousness, is, you did not see me. Ooh, I don't know, y'all. It's Kool-Aid gum. I've been on, like, a kick of trying different Kool-Aids, and I think what I realized is I don't like Kool-Aid anymore. But you have grape cherry and tropical punch so i will share this with somebody um yeah you know, I, I can't be chewing gum all the time so let me just try it nothing like watching somebody chew gum I mean, it's just sugar, right? And artificial flavors. And glucose syrup. It's fine. Um, just thought I'd try it. But yeah, my dad hated grape gum. He thought I had the worst smell on the planet and would not let me chew it in his presence. FYI. So yeah, so just a little haul. It was fun. I'm going to get used to getting in there. And I mean, I don't think I'm going to keep trying the food things unless it's something I think I really want to try. Like, like these two. But these weird little things, uh, unless I see someone saying how good they are. I mean, this is good. I don't regret that. I'll eat that. Other two, you know, it's fun to try. But in a world where the cost of, the cost of gas to get to the Dollar Tree, y'all, I'm not sure what's going on. But I'll never, I you know, I got a novelty pen, one of the new ones with a ball and a, like a star coming up, but Clara has carried that off twice now. So she thinks it's for her. I will never not buy a novelty pen, if, but I don't like have to have everyone in the series. But one or here, one or two, and some stickers, you know. I really think I did pretty good. Well, I hope you guys, are you excited? Have you been to the Dollar Tree? Do you want to go to the Dollar Tree? What are you looking for at the Dollar Tree? If I watch the hauls and I really want to go get everything, I did see a lot of stuff people had hauled, but I think for me to get a tchotchke or decorative thing has to be pretty spectacular. Yeah, it really does. For me, a bucket, gardening stuff, cleaners, that's one thing. And if I see more headbands that, um, you know, are cute, I'm not going to buy one every time I go, but it's nice to have a choice. Yeah, but this I don't regret, you guys. I just think this is adorable. I maybe regret not getting another two because I could see them on a shelf now in my studio, but it's fine. <sighs> okay, guys, take care, and maybe I'll see you.